Hey guys, welcome to today's vlog. I figured I am gonna vlog the weekend. I like to share vlogs with you guys. I feel like you guys like it, so that's what I'm gonna do today. Um, I don't know how many days it's gonna be. It's Friday today, so yes, it's Friday. It's been a long week. If you haven't been following me on Instagram, I need to catch you up because a lot has been going on in this house and I've been very stressed, very, very stressed, but it's okay, we're gonna talk about it in a little bit. But for now, I'm gonna go, I got a new rug for our living room and I bought it, so let me backtrack. I bought a new rug. First of all, you know what, subscribe. Are you subscribed? Make sure, the red button, make it gray. Make sure you're subscribed. I'm gonna wait. Okay, did you do it? Okay, all right. So now that you're subscribed and you're part of the family, I can tell you about my life. So, <laughs> I've ordered a rug from Home Depot. My friend Ashley had it and she thought it, she thinks it's good and she likes it. And just for my personal taste, it's not thin or thick enough. It's pretty thin. Um, I think it'd be good for like under a dining room table or something like that. But as my living room rug, I wanted something more cozy because we don't really have a lot of rugs in the house besides in the bedrooms. So I wanted a nice rug for the living room since it's all wood floors. So I ordered a new rug. I'm going to bring that rug back. The one from um, Home Depot and then I got a new rug and it's from Target and it came in today I'm gonna show you guys. I can't wait. I got a vacuum real quick the area the floor and then we're going to lay the rug down So let's go do that. I'm so excited the rug it's so cute it looks so good i really like let me open this window oh, it doesn't matter i thought it would make that go away but yeah looks good tour helped me put it under the couch looks cute just need to get some new um pillow covers for those pillows but i really like it i think it looks really good part today um i was listening to a podcast obsessed with um airpods if you don't have them they're a stay-at-home mom's dream um but anyway i wanted to tell you guys what's really been going on and the struggles that i've been going through the past couple like this week we have mice in our house and I've been keeping you guys updated on Instagram and letting you guys know about these mice, but they've really been putting a toll on my mental health. Like, I'm not even kidding about this. This probably sounds so dramatic and ridiculous, but like, I don't even want to eat because they're in my pantry and they're under my stove. So like, I don't want to cook in the stove because I don't want to be cooking up mice i don't know um so it's been putting a toll on me putting a toll on my sleep because i haven't been able to sleep very well because i'm scared like they're gonna be like in my bed or around my bed or just in my room in general so i've been struggling with that and it probably sounds dramatic and ridiculous but it's the truth that's what's been going on um but i think we I hope have under control. Um, let me backtrack and tell you the story real quick if you don't know. So last Saturday, my husband and I were watching a show on TV and all the lights were out in the bedroom, or I'm sorry, in the living room. And um, we saw something move, like a shadow. 
so then we were like what the heck was that and so i saw it and then he saw it again the second time and i saw it too and he was like oh my gosh what was that and so we got up and i got on the island of the counter and he was like it's a mouse it's a mouse and i was like oh no 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 because i didn't know like the size i didn't know anything about it i've never had mice like really on the floor in my house i've had mice like in my attic in my house but that's it um i never saw them so uh, yeah bought a mouse trap that next day on sunday and it was like a nice one it was like one that catches them and then you just release them and it's great so because we just thought it was one like oh one just got in the house wow but to our surprise the following day i called our housing and i was just letting them know like hey we had a mouse in our house um if you want to check out and see like if we have more or just let you know if there's an opening or something and she's like okay whatever so they send out the maintenance guy the maintenance guy looks he says he sees mouse poop so he sets out like um sticky traps to like catch them in and long story short again we catch one in the sticky trap i call and they have the exterminator come out he looks he also sets more traps and um yesterday we caught another mouse in the trap and the maintenance guy filled there's like a hole behind the stove that i think maybe they're coming in from it's like the gas line and it's like a pipe in a hole but it's like like this much space really for them to get in so he put one of those gristle um things they use on the stove in there because they don't like metal and when they bite it they like run away so yeah so he put that there and um so far we're okay there is one in our pantry that is and uh i need to deep clean our pantry because i'm disgusted i just hope that that one was just in here before he filled the hole and got trapped and now he's dead so anyway so i would need to deep clean our pantry and i've been really stressed about it and having a hard time with it and disgusted about it so it's because we have a new build we live in an apartment where it's a new build we're also on the bottom floor the people next door are little college kids i'd say and they uh like to do extracurricular activities that would cause mice considering they leave their garage open and all that stuff so fun times of living in an apartment i never want to live in an apartment again but hopefully we get this under control but that's where i've been and that's what's like updated on me as far as like what's going on in our house and all that stuff also i'm having the chandelier for our bedroom hung up on monday night so i will have that video of my bedroom makeover up on friday i hope i know it's been a long time coming but my husband isn't really handy with electrical stuff so we needed to have someone help us put the chandelier up that is so hopefully on friday i can have the room makeover done i can't wait to show you guys my room i'm obsessed with it it's so cozy so comfy everything that i wanted so minimal i love it so anyway if you didn't know i'm re i redid my bedroom and here's a little i card right here if you want to watch all the decor that i bought for it or see all the decor that i bought for it um but anyway i am going to maybe go grab a snack um from starbucks possibly i'm not sure it's 319 and i haven't really eaten much today like i told you guys like i don't want to eat like i'm disgusted um and it sounds so bad but i just like don't want to eat anything at home um because i'm grossed out that there's mice poop everywhere and disgusting i'm a very clean person so knowing that there's mice poop in my house in places i'm not happy about it <laughs> uh, and i'm really grossed out so hey guys so it's the next day we're in the car um my husband's returning a rug that i bought from home depot he's in there right now we're returning the rug and um and then we got to drop off some stuff at goodwill around here the goodwill isn't very close from what we realized so um we got to make a trip out of it so it's gonna be i think it's like 20 minutes away 20 to 30 minutes away i'm not really sure so we're gonna do that here in a minute but we're like parked like up on the side and so many people are looking at me right now <laughs> kids are actually not feeling too great um victoria has a runny nose cough cold all that fun stuff and so does jackson so they're just hanging in the back but yeah we're not probably gonna do a lot this weekend just because they don't really feel too well they don't have fevers or anything just runny nose and i think they probably got it from gymnastics and swim which is 
normal or they could have got it you know from the target shopping cart honestly who knows um but anyway that's what we're up to saturday we just had some dunkin donuts we had um the heart-shaped donuts and regular like chocolate donuts and my husband and i were like we haven't had donuts like this in forever we don't ever eat donuts we eat we try to eat really healthy or i should say we've been trying to recently the past like two three weeks well maybe like a month now we've been eating really good and then saturdays are our cheat days and like we go all out on our cheat days which are not it's not really good to do that but he goes more all out i just kind of go all out so. so we're home i'm going to do the pantry real quick um i don't know how much crazy before and afters it's going to be or look like but um i just want to clean out the mouse poop <laughs> and make sure it's really clean and then i think i might go get okay i'm back but i don't know if it's gonna be a huge dramatic like before and after beautiful but at least it'll be clean and i figured i could inspire you why not to do your own pantry because i know my pantry needs it bad so let's tackle this thing i'm nervous i hope there's no mice in here i'm gonna start down at the bottom because that's where the mice poop is you know it still hurts a little bit but not that much Cause if you want somebody else Who am I to judge I've been thinking about you all the time But that's alright I'm starting to get used to it Think I'll survive I met you in the summer When you left it was cold Said we loved one another Guess that we were wrong I met you in the summer myself now and then i'll try to laugh but i'll cry a bit as well i was never any good at being away from you i met you in the summer when you left it was cold. all right so here is the finished pantry i just need to get a um thing for my flower because it's not in a it's just in a bag and i feel like it's not really airtight so i need to get that which is up there but for now it's fine so that's all my baking stuff sugar and then the cereal this is just like bread and oatmeal and breakfast stuff tea coffee this is like our everyday use stuff and then down here this is like the kids stuff well not that <laughs> but this stuff right here is the kids stuff and food and snacks and water dog food but wow there was mice poop in all of these containers and it is so disgusting and that was so gross so i'm glad it's clean Looks way better, way nicer. Look, it's snowing. We got our first snow day. Yeah! Snow. Big snowflake. Yeah, on your tongue. Yay. Walking it crunches. Shh, 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 shh. Look at Lil, you look so cute with the snow on you. of the year i mean it snowed a little bit in the basket it snowed a little bit a couple days like a while ago i guess but it was didn't stick like this this is our first real snow okay so we just came in from playing in the snow i want to show you this cute little thing this little outfit i got from target it is so cute and so comfy it's cheetah little crop little sweatpants and the sweatpants are so cozy and they have pockets 
which are a must in my world. How cute. Target. Target find. Ladies, get you a man who does dishes and cooks. Oh, man. <laughs> Did you have fun in the snow? Yeah. Look at your cheeks. So red. I feel like I'm always in the bathroom with you guys. I don't know why, but the lighting is so good in here. And, um... I spend a lot of time in here. So anyway, I wanted to show you guys, I'm gonna apply some of my Blinky Fly lashes and some of them are like off of the tracks or where they're supposed to be, but um, I've been loving these. I told you guys a couple vlogs ago that I've been loving these and I really have been. I haven't applied them in like two weeks and I want to because it makes me feel good. And if you don't know much about them, they um, are like lash extensions, but you can do at home kind of. They last for seven days and you put them like underneath instead of on top of. And um, you don't put them like on the waterline. I'll show you guys in a minute. You put them like right on your lash line and this glue that they have to purchase too, um, it helps them this like stays for seven days and then so you can get them wet in the shower like obviously not like rub but you can get them wet in the shower and then um you know do your normal thing like makeup and stuff as far as like washing around the eye area i always wash my face i just don't go like this like on my eyes how i normally would if i didn't have them on i just do a little more gentle and then i use a washcloth and i kind of gently wash around my eyes just being more careful um if you want them to last even longer just like be even more careful maybe not wear eyeshadow totally up to you but anyway i've been loving them and i have a code as well if you want to check them out um this video isn't sponsored by them or anything or she didn't ask me to talk about them but it is a woman-owned business the girl is super sweet she's so nice and um she gave me a code so i've had a code for a while i share it on my instagram all the time but i'll have the code in the description bar if you want to check it out um but i highly recommend picking up the glue this is the lash lock and then i use the style darling the darlings or no it's just called the darling they're very natural but also glam um they don't make you look like super overdone but you also look like obviously you know you just look a little bit more put together than normally would have um so i really like them and i have like i said a zillion times i have like more of smaller eyes so i actually only use three sometimes four but i usually only use three clusters because my eyes are pretty small so let's apply these babies i gotta grab my mirror and then we can apply this is probably not going to be a good angle either way because it's very difficult to apply them for me so like still well not difficult but it's definitely a challenge still so i think i have tweezers somewhere put my hair up so i didn't even tell you guys that today is sunday um i thought you maybe just got the hint but it's sunday and so yesterday after i cleaned out the pantry we kind of just hung around the house we ended up having taco bell for um for dinner and um then today we woke up went to a cat shelter and um, we weren't actually able to hold or touch any cats because you have to make an appointment due to covid and everything um so i just filled out an application to check out some cats so maybe my next vlog will be looking at cats or getting a cat potentially we don't know honestly honestly want to like meet the cat and see if they'd be a good fit for us and stuff so that's that we may get a cat we may not i'll keep you guys updated you'll probably find out sooner on instagram than here but um yeah i'll let you guys know i don't know we have to meet the cat see if the cat would be good with our dog obviously and then the kids as well so we'll see we may may get a kitten may not get a kitten and um so we did that and then we went to target and just picked up groceries we need just like a few little groceries and then i just picked up this cute little set that i showed you guys earlier but it's so cute i'm wearing a medium in the top for reference if you are curious and then an extra small in the bottoms and so cute so anyway wanna be with you till we grow old just tell me you'll stay or take me away i want you for myself every single okay so i just finished um, it was, I haven't done it in so long, so it was kind of difficult. It was kind of difficult for me, but here they are. They're on. They look really good. This is them. Don't they look nat- like, not natural, but they look like, you know, like I went and got eyelash extensions. And it's a fraction of the fraction of a fraction of the cost. So, anyway, I really like them. I think they look so good. 
But anyway, that's gonna be it for today's vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to check out all the links and everything listed down below because like I tell you guys all the time, I list everything down below. So make sure you check it out um, for codes, discounts, things that I'm wearing, anything I talk about in the videos, check the description bar. Leave me a comment, let me know what you thought about today's vlog, and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye guys. Bye. You said my